Hello students, welcome back to Rosie Maths class. Today we shall discuss question number 3 of 1.4 figure it out. Which sequence do you get when you start to add the all ones sequence up? Second part is what sequence do you get when you add the all ones sequence up and down? So for this you should know what is all one sequence. All one sequence means all the numbers are one. So one next number one next number one next number one so it goes on like that if you just have one in this sequence so that's what we call all ones sequence now the first part is when you add the all ones up up means you move to the next number like one and then the next number again moving up to the next number okay so we will see the first part one will be one okay next go till here 1 plus 1 so 1 plus 1 is 2 start from here going up 1 plus 1 plus 1 that equals to 3 again start from here move up 4 times 1 so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 so what do we get we get 1 2 3 4 and so on that means when we go up we get counting numbers so we will write when we add the all ones sequence up we get counting numbers this is the counting number sequence the next part of the question is what sequence do you get when you add the all one sequence up and down okay so it is up and down we will write the sequence 1 1 1 1 like this okay now we have to move up first and then down so first one is 1 1 is equal to 1 start from here go up and then down so 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to 3 again start from here now go up till here and then come back from here so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 that is equal to 5 start from here go till fourth position and come back to the first position so 1 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1 fourth position and then coming back again this type of questions we have done previously also this is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 Similar pattern up and down question we have done previously also in question number 2. If you see here, see these are counting numbers. So we move up and then down. Again up till 3 and then down. Similarly here also we are doing the same thing. But then here we just have 1s. Okay. So now what pattern do we get? 1, 3, 5, 7. Then the next one we can say is 9. So that means we are getting all odd numbers. So you can write when we add the all ones sequence up and down we get odd numbers or odd number sequence. I hope this concept is clear to you. Thank you.